Hello everyone, share life and share technology. Today I will share with you how to downgrade the EMUI system firmware of Huawei mobile phone. This method is applicable to all Huawei mobile phones from EMUI 11 to EMUI 10. So the question is, why do we want to downgrade the system? This is because the latest version of the EMUI was failed to install the Google GMS services when using the new method to install the Google GMS or encountered a warning from the Google Services Assistant said that the current system is not supported and the installation cannot be continued. Installing Google Play services at the bottom of the system is the best method and the user experience is the best. If you don't know how to install, please see the detailed steps in my previous video. Click on the link in the upper right corner of this video to watch the detailed steps. Well, in this video, I will give you a detailed demonstration of how to downgrade your Huawei P40, Nova 6, Mate 40, etc. applicable to all Huawei phones. Of course, please back up before downgrade as all your data will be erased after the downgrade of your EMUI. Ok, now let's start. Ok, now let's move to Huawei's official website. You can see here, I will put this uh, website address down below this video for you to uh, download this uh, Huawei's high suit. You can download the Windows version or the Mac version according to your PC's uh, system. Then after you download it, then you will need to do well uh, to install this uh, high suit into your PC. Then uh, you connect with your mobile phone. So then we will use this high suit to downgrade. Okay, so I already uh, downloaded this uh, high suit into my uh, my PC. Then I will uh, install it and uh, double click. Then you will see this uh, installation information. Then click, uh, just click yes, agree. Click the agree button and click OK to install this uh, Huawei's high suit into my uh, my PC. Then uh, I will use the uh, Huawei's official high suit to do the downgrade from. Uh, your uh, Huawei's like uh, P40 to downgrade the uh, latest EMUI 11 to EMUI 10. And uh, after that, then you can uh, install the Google GMS into your mobile phone because the latest version will uh, encounter the uh, not compatible with the uh, Google Fire. So we will use Google Fire as I mentioned in, in the previous uh, videos. Google Fire can be used to install the uh, Google Google Play services. It's very straightforward, very easy to do that after you downgrade. Okay, now uh, we already uh, installed this uh, uh, high suit and uh, let's check move to my phone. Let's have a look at uh, my mobile phone's version. You can see this is my uh, latest version 11, EMUI 11. So uh, but it is not uh, compatible with the uh, Google Fire. Let's have a look that uh, the Google Fire already installed, but uh, I cannot uh, install it to GMS. You can see after I click, it will crash. Yes, uh, first first step, I needed to, according to the instruction, the Google Fire said I needed to set uh, the date time back to 2019. Then uh, switch off the uh, automatic date time to switch back to 2019. Then uh, after that, then I go back to Google Fire to start the installation. You can see it, it was crashed. So I cannot install the Google uh, install the Google's uh, GMS uh, in the latest version of uh, EMUI 11. So that's why we needed to downgrade the uh, EMUI 11 to the EMUI 10. You can see this is the latest version EMUI 11 and uh, Google Fire cannot be uh, in user to install. Okay, so now let's uh, connect my phone with the uh, high suit to connect with each other. Then you can see there's uh, uh, some information instructions on my PC said uh, I needed to agree to use the uh, transfer, the file transfer mode, file transfer mode to uh, connect with the, uh, my PC. Then uh, to authorize to use the HDB, to the Huawei's HDB uh, connection 
which means、uh, the Huawei High Suite can connect with your mobile phone directly and、uh, to、uh, install the related the related software. Okay, so、uh, you click OK for the HDB. Then it said、uh, you needed to,、uh, yeah.、Uh, now、uh, there's、uh, some authorities. Uh, requirement. Then you click OK to agree those uh, uh, authorities' requirement. Click OK to give the、uh, authority to the high suit. Then、uh, you need to click、uh, confirm OK to、uh, give them、uh, permissions. Now you will see the、uh, code, some code of、uh, uh, um, on the phone. Then you need to key in this code into your high suit to、uh, make the authorization to. Let the high suit connect with your phones. Okay, now the phone was connected with the high suit. Now let's put our phone on the desk. On the desk, then、uh, we click the、uh, system update button. Just、uh, you can see, this is my、uh, version of、uh, mobile phone. And see this、uh, up up a system upgrade here. This button, click that button. Then、uh, there are some、uh, instructions. Just have a look. And we will、uh, using this、uh, system upgrade function to to check the latest version of your mobile phone. After that, then、uh, you can see that、uh, the, your version is、uh, the latest version of EMUI 11. Then click that blue blue fonts, so the blue characters, blue、uh, blue words to see the、uh, older version of your mobile phone. Just click those blue words. Now you can see this、uh, some words uh, said uh, the uh, late uh, the uh, previous version of the EMUI is 10.1, 10.1. So uh, you um, because my PC is in Chinese,、uh, so if you are using the English PC, English、uh, character, English version of your PC, then you will see those in、uh, English that uh, this uh, previous version is 10.1. Then you can.、Uh, Select that uh, old uh, old version and、uh, to roll back. I mean, roll back the uh, your uh, EMUI to the 10.1, because my PC is using Chinese, so you will see this Chinese character. And、uh, and your PC is in English or in、uh, other kind of、uh, characters, then you will see the、uh, the language of your country. Okay, so said、uh, you need to back up your data. Then let's um. Then click OK. Then it we will see this、uh, status bar said uh, uh, the room. I mean the the 10.1 EMUI 10.1 is、uh, download. It needed some time. Yeah, maybe one or two hours. It depend on your internet connection speed.、Um, if it is fast, then it will be fast because my speed is very slow. So I wait several hours after the uh, whole uh, ROM in、uh, downloaded. It uh, the uh, the size of this ROM is around five gigabyte, five gigabyte of the 10.1 EMUI version. Okay, now we uh, uh, we are nearly almost、uh, down finish the download of the、uh, EMUI 10.1. Okay, now、uh, after the 99 percent, almost nearly、uh, finished. Then、uh, 100 percent finish download finished. Then uh, the uh, The high suit will start the process of、uh, install the、uh, install the room into your mobile phone. So、uh, in the installing speed, relatively speaking, is faster than the、uh, download speed of the、uh, uh, 10.1 ROM. So you will be just、uh, keep a patient, keep be patient, and.、Uh, Patience, impatience, and、uh, the wait. It maybe takes several several minutes, and、uh, after the status bar into get into the 100%, then you will see your mobile phone will be、uh, restart. Okay, now you can see it was the rollback was finished, the installation was finished. Then then uh, let's uh, have a look of our、uh, mobile phone. What happened? Then you can see、uh, my mobile phone was restarted. Yeah, it was restarted, and you can see the、uh, logo of、uh, was restart logo and it restarted. And it said that EMUI is formatting formatting the system, and you, all your data will be lost. That's why I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Then you needed to、uh, back up all your data and.、Uh, Uh, otherwise, your data will be lost. Okay, now finish the formatting of your of your system. Then we will start、uh, an, 
can uh, still keep on the uh, formatting. Okay, now your your mobile phone is go back to the factory reset automatically. You can see, then the mobile phone will restart again to restart again, and uh, then you will be see this uh, logo. Yeah, almost start. See this logo, and uh, the next step. Yeah, we already in the uh, first run of your mobile phone system. Now you need to select your language. Here I will choose Chinese, but in your country you can choose your uh, language of your country. Then uh, connect next, and it says some instructions um, in your own country's language. Maybe in English if you select English. Okay, I, because I select Chinese, so that's why you see some Chinese. Okay, just click continue to set some initial settings of your mobile phone to make it uh, work for you. Then. Uh, just to click some tick out some some settings and click next have all instruction next some uh, figures to operate uh, the uh, uh, system with the uh, navigation without the navigation bar just with a signature with your gesture to control your mobile phone just do some practice and uh, click finished we nearly almost finished yeah now let's uh, see this is a new phone, new fresh phone. Let's check out the uh, EMUI version. Now you can see the EMUI version is 10.1. Yeah, it's 10.1. Now we already nearly successfully uh, down. Yeah, we already successfully downgraded the uh, mobile phone. Then you can uh, using the Google Fire to install the Google uh, GMS, the Google Play services into your mobile phone. It will be compatible with the uh, uh, 10.1 EMUI. And the Google Assistant Assistant will also be compatible with your EMUI 10.1. Then you can use the uh, Google Play services perfectly with with Google uh, Play Store perfectly.